So I got this uh this plate in. So it goes in there. Like that. This grid across. Um see the thing I was telling you is that on the uh, other ones I've seen, I can't see where to grab. I guess you're supposed to grab right here. It's not a one inch. See right there, and then the flat side right there. It's not a one inch, it's not a one and sixteenths, it's not one and eight. I don't know what the fuck it is, honestly. I just don't know what the fuck it is. I was grabbing from right here though. Like uh from right here with the one inch. And it was just uh I was having to go like this and turn it. And like this right there. But uh anyways, um so we got this thing right here, right? And uh, that's to put into the block. That's the other piece of the tool. So uh, this is top dead center on these. See, these can move independently now that I loosened up uh, those. And uh, once again, um, why use these torque bolts? I just, I don't know. I don't understand. You have to have two people to do this. You cannot hold this here with a wrench because it, it cams out and then hold over there. You, you can't. You have to put it on here and then push, or else it's going to come out. I mean, and it's on there tight. I, I used a half inch impact and it wouldn't come loose. You got to pull these loose and then see now these could move, these uh, cam gears can move independently from the camshafts. Now, they were on there tight though. They were on there real tight. I, I, it was real tight. Um, so there's that special tool right there. And, uh, so there's where that special tool goes, way down there. And I'm sure it'd be easier from the bottom, probably. I don't even know if you can see. I'll try to get you in there. Right there. It goes there, but, uh, yeah, look, look to get it from here. And then there's more room down there, it looks like, though. But, uh, and then you got that sensor in your way, you got a sensor right here in your way. And uh, I just don't want to fiddle around with it. I just don't want to. I'll just leave it right there. I don't even want to take it out. So in other words, I don't even, I'm not using this tool. I'm using this tool right here. It's something I've had, something I've used before. It does not work on the V6 though. It only works on an engine like this. Uh, basically it just goes in and threads in. And then this thing right here with TDC, it goes up, it goes up and down. So I got this perfectly at TDC. So you can see the notches, it'll go up and then it'll go start to go down. So I'll count the notches. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then ten. About ten and uh, ten and a half. And that's right there at TDC on that one. Um, this tool works pretty good. It threads right into the spark plug hole. And all I did to clean that stuff out was I, I just stuck a rag in there, and then with the um, I just stuck a rag in there with um, what do you call it? A screwdriver and just soaked it up. That's it. I'm gonna clean up the rest of them. But I, I just wanted to show you um how you could set top dead center without having that special tool. And this is a special tool too. But you can, in all reality, you could just and I've done it before. I just uh, you stick a screwdriver. You stick a screwdriver. And you got to be real careful though. You see it, it'll go up and down and up. So you get it to where it goes up and then it comes down a little bit and then you just, you can mark it right here, like to the head. This is just more precise, this tool. This is exactly what that tool's made for. That's what that tool's made for. I got it for about like 14 bucks, something like that online. It's just a top dead center tool. And uh, so this thing goes inside and it touches the top of the piston. And then when you're going up and down, um, it, it you could count the numbers you'll see it go up and I already knew I was at top dead center because of the I left the timing belt on and then uh, I, I put this and then um and then uh, so I knew the bottom was at top dead center uh, almost exactly and then uh, I loosened up before I even put this tool on though I loosened up uh, these because it was pain and ass you need two people to do it you just need two people to do it and then I put this tool in here, and uh, and uh, that that's 
how you could get that's a, a, another way that you can get top dead center using something like this and uh, the thing is you could use this on any vehicle which is cool so well not any vehicle it's for the uh, the this spark plug that has a 15 or a 5 8 but in other words if you don't have that tool you could use something like that you could buy that and you could use it on multiple vehicles so I mean honestly I'd probably just rather get that but uh anyways I got a set like that I just came in here like this and I looked it just took me it's gonna take me less time and you know time is money I don't have a lot of time I, I got multiple things I have to do so when if anything could send me five save me five or ten minutes I'm gonna do it I have this tool and I did it I just used that tool it went up barely a little bit and then went down barely a little bit so I went I just turned it rotated back just a little teeny bit until it's right at top dead center I was looking at the marks and that's what those marks are there for so that's just um I'm just gonna go on go in there and that'll probably be for uh tomorrow I'll be fooling around with that tomorrow I'm done for today um that's where all that stuff came from and uh this is a six millimeter hex so anyways that's a way to set TDC with uh using a tool like that so uh anyways it's just a TDC tool you can go on Amazon look up a uh, top dead center tool and it should come up it's probably like less than 20 bucks so I've used it a couple times you can't put it on an engine that's like a V mounted though like a like a like a V like that because uh, the piston goes up and then the, the block is like the cylinder heads uh, you know sideways and it'll probably damage this tool but you could use a tool like that thanks for watching comment rate subscribe